Yeah, I joke from Guy Ritchie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So putting together a story that balances so many characters, so many mysteries within a mystery, and trying to keep the audience guessing, how do you go about not only writing one of them, but two of them and a third coming up? <laughs> well, I don't know yet about it. I mean, I know we're doing it, but I don't know how I'll do it. So uh, ask, ask me in a few years. But um, well, I mean, I, 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 you know, the way I write, I work in, with structure. So the first 80 percent of the process is like mapping it out. I need like a roadmap of the whole script before I can sit down and start typing, which I think really helps with with this type of genre. Um, but the other big answer is, and this is the reason why it was exciting for me to keep making them. You know, this movie is completely different than the first movie. Not just the cast and the setting, but the story itself is trying like this whole different. Thing, and that'll be the same thing for the third. It'll be different than the first two. Sure. Um, so for me, that's kind of, and for Daniel also, it feels like surprising ourselves as opposed to feeling like we're just turning the handle and spinning on another one, keeping it creatively exciting um, I don't know, with the genre I love. Uh, Excellent. That, that's kind of the key to it. You know? So you recently confirmed, speaking of Daniel, that Benoit Blanc is gay in the films. Are we going to see that explored anymore in the future? I don't know. I mean, I, I, I think that's... You know, it's a fact about his character. The reality is these are not movies really about the detective's sexuality. Sure. That's kind of almost a thing of the genre. The detective has to be set outside of the realm of human drama that's going on with all the suspects. So, And the other thing is, and Daniel and I have talked about this, I mean, I think that seeing little details of his life is a good thing. I feel like we both want him to remain somewhat enigmatic. I don't see like diving into his home life as right, much yeah. as I would love an entire movie with just him and <laughs> no spoilers, him and his partner in this. I want to say the actor who's playing it because it's a fun moment when sure. we reveal him. But, uh, <laughs> anyway, but uh, but yeah, I, I but I, I really like the fact that he's gay and it, it, you know, and I, I tried with the cameo in the movie to think who would it make me the most happy to see him be right. with. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, and we're at time, but I just have to ask any updates on that. Star Wars trilogy? No, I've just I've got my hands full with this right now. Sure. And Kathy and I still talk about it. It's still something I hope happens in the future, but I, I don't know. Hope it happens too. Thanks, Thanks so much. I really appreciate, appreciate it. it. Thank you.